Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of intestinal ascaresis. A 7 year old boy came with low abdominal cramping pain and frequency of micturition. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the high frequency view of the pelvic region. You can see the urinary bladder and beside that you can see some small intestinal loops. You can see multiple echogenic tubular motile structures within the small intestinal lumen. These linear tubular structures are the ascaris lumbicoides as these worms filled small intestinal loops are adjacent to the urinary bladder they literally are irritating the urinary bladder wall. So the frequency of micturition complaint that the boy gave is possibly due to the irritation done by this worm filled small intestinal bowel loops adjacent to it. So this is a case of intestinal ascaresis. You can see they are moving. Here's the picture, you can see the small intestinal loops are fluid filled distended and you can see lot of worms within the lumen. They are almost occluding the lumen here. And the pictures and you can see multiple echogenic worms within the intestinal loops. So in summary, multiple tubular echogenic motile structures are noted within the small intestinal lumen adjacent to the urinary bladder, suggesting it as a case of intestinal ascaresis. Now the take home message. In endemic as well as non-endemic areas, if a regular abdominal ultrasound of a child complaining about the abdominal pain shows no definite organic abnormality, then do not end the examination without searching for intestinal worms. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.